solution collide and suspension here you can see in the first beaker we have a solution in the second beaker you can see we have collide and in the third beaker we can observe like this is a suspension in today's video we are going to learn what is solution collide and suspension what are their examples and some properties what is the solution a solution is a homogeneous mixture homo means same of two or more components in which the particle size is smaller than 1 nanometer it means the particles of the solutions are very small that we can't see them with the naked eye then we have some examples common examples of solutions are sugar in water salt in water soda water vinegar in vinegar water and acetic acid makes a solution because they makes a homogeneous mixture all of them makes a homogeneous mixture they make a same and uniform mixture that's why they are a solution in a solution all the components appear as a single phase because they makes a uniform mixture then we have some properties of solution it is a homogeneous mixture as we discussed earlier solution is a homogeneous mixture it's a uniform mixture it's same its particles are too tiny and have a diameter of less than 1 nanometer because its particles are so small that's why we are unable to see them from the naked eye particles don't scatter a beam of light passing through it and hence the part of the light is not visible because here the particles of the solution are very very small and they are small enough that they don't scatter a beam of a light that's why we are unable to see the path of the light the components of a mixture cannot be separated using filtration or any physical means why again because the particles of the solution are very very small that we are unable to filtrate them or we are unable to separate them from any other mean here is another definition of solution we can say when solvent and solute mix together they form a solution they form a homogeneous and a uniform mixture and that homogeneous and uniform mixture has a single phase and this is called as a solution what is collide we can define collides as a mixture where one of the substance is split into very minute particles which are dispersed throughout a second substance the minute particles are known as colloidal particles here is the dispersion phase some of the particles of a substance dispersed uniformly in the whole mixture here we have some examples of collide blood clouds gold soul milk are some examples of collide now here how clouds act as a collide clouds contains air which is the dispersion medium and droplets of water as a dispersed phase now there are two mediums dispersion medium and dispersed phase the first one the air is the dispersion medium and in that dispersion medium say for example here the air is the dispersion medium and the droplets of water that are dispersed in between they are the dispersed phase and this is why the clouds act as a collide then we have some properties of collides it is a heterogeneous mixture the size of the collide particles is very small their particle size ranges between 1 to 1000 nanometers the size of the particles of collide is somehow bigger than the solution particles but still they are very small it shows the tyndall effect now this is a unique property that collide shows collides are the only one that shows tyndall effect because their particles are dispersed throughout the mixture and when a beam of light pass through it they scatter the beam of light and when they scatter the beam of light this effect is called as tyndall effect they don't settle down when left undisturbed for some time due to the gravitational pull it means colloidal solutions are quite stable just as solutions they cannot be separated by the filtration process yes it's right that the colloidal particles are somehow larger than the 
solution particles but still they are very small that is why we are unable to separate them from any physical means then here you can see this is how collides show a tindal effect this is a beam of light or this is the source of light here we have a solution in the solution you can see the light is not scattering it's just passing from here but in the mixture of water and milk which is a collide so when the beam of light or when the source of light pass through this mixture all the light scattered here and there and this is called as a tindal effect and this is speciality of the collides what is a suspension a suspension is defined as a heterogeneous mixture in which the solid particles are spread throughout the liquid without dissolving in it now suspension it's not like solution and collide the particles of the suspension are big enough we can see them with the naked eye here we have some examples of suspension muddy water milk of magnesia sand particles suspended in water floor in water slate lime for white washing now all of these are examples of the suspension here we have some properties of suspension a suspension is a heterogeneous mixture the size of the solute particles in a suspension is quite large and we can see them from the naked eye very easily the particles of the suspension are big enough they don't pass through the filter paper so a suspension can be separated by the filtration or any other physical mean the suspension is unstable the particles of a suspension settle down after some time just because of the gravitational pull here we can see all these particles from our naked eye after some time due to the gravitational pull because all of them are unstable so they will be settled down into the bottom just like this let's conclude for today's lecture in today's lecture we talk about collide solution and suspension solution is made up of solute plus solvent and the particles of solution are very very small that we can't see them from the naked eye then we talk about collide collide has a unique property that collide show tindal effect and what is tindal effect tindal effect is the scattering of light when we pass the source of light from the collide mixture then the particles of collide are intermediate between the particles of the solution and the particles of suspension then we talk about suspension suspension is a heterogeneous mixture and the particles are big enough that we can see them from our naked eye so yes this is all about solution collide and suspension if you want more such videos please don't forget to subscribe thank you very much